have as much attention on it as possible. <laughs> Lucy Krauss loves to sew. She started at age six, and her mom says by age nine... She had the idea to make things to donate was when she really wanted to get into it. So. Yeah, now I feel like zipping away. <laughs> Lucy, who has autism, used to think her kindness made her weak. But then I realized that my kindness is what makes me stronger. Lucy's strength has led her to sew more than a thousand quilts and stuffed animals to donate to worthy causes over the past four years. She just has great ideas and we, we've we always said she's like a girl with ten hearts in one. With the help of her mom and grandmother, she spread the love of warmth and comfort. Her most recent donation went to Legacy Salmon Creek Medical Center. It was a big one. She said, I'll be here, but you better have have a cart because we've got 150 stuffed animals and quilts. <laughs> Shirley Gross works with Legacy Salmon Creek's foundation. She says Lucy's creations go to comfort kids during their hospital stays. Who doesn't love a bunny? <laughs> and it's soft flannels, which is really nice. Shirley loves the donations and thinks a lot of Lucy too. It gives you hope <laughs> to know that there are young people who who I think extraordinarily think outside themselves to be able to think about other kids. This teenager decided to donate to the hospital after going to the ER suffering from an allergic reaction. They didn't have any stuffies to give, so I was thinking, wouldn't it be wonderful if someone could make some for them? Which one are you sewing? The gingerbread man. Then I just decided to start sewing for them. Lucy's giving got her in a book called Unselfish Kids. She earned a spot because of who she is. So we try just to find ways to support her so that she can get these big ideas, make them happen. And Yeah. Tim Gordon, KGW News. What a great way to end the show. The hospital has already given out all the donated items, so Lucy is making more to resupply. She is a very talented, talented yeah. seamstress as well. Just keep it going, Lucy.